hello everyone so today we are going to see about the j tree so j tree is the additional constructor or component which are available in the swing package so if you want to show the data in the hierarchical form so we can use the j tree so j tree extend the j component so if you want to see the data in the tree wise so we can use the j tree just for example if you go to the any website then it will shows the department once you click the department it will shows the hidden uh, department just like as a computer electrical mechanical okay so if you want to create such type of hierarchy then we can use the j tree so what are the constructor available in the j tree that is the j tree has table j tree with object array j tree with tree no j tree with result so these are the four constructor available in the j tree so it is very important uh, the name is bit one more question will be asked from this so we should have to know the constructor uh, which are the constructor available for the j tree then j tree will generate the event when a node is expanded or collapsed so when we created the tree then it create once we uh, click on the node so it will be shows the hidden or collapsed okay so it will generate some event so add tree expansion listener and remote tree expansion listener these two listener will be used okay so so for this event in the third unit we have the event uh, handling so we can see in the uh, when we see we can see this in the details okay then what are the signature for that so void add tree expansion listener and void remote tree expansion listener that will be the two methods will be used okay then the j tree so if you create the j tree we have to add the node by using using the add method so default mutable tree node this constructor will be used for adding the node if you add the top node that is the select when then before that uh, after that we created a uh, color so once we click on the current it will show the name of the color atom then uh, we have created the uh, fruit then we click on the fruit it should show the items of the fruit so for that the top hierarchy means top node for that we can use by using the default mutable tree node and also the below node we can also use by using the default mutable tree node so tree expansion even is also available so it is having the part get part method and tree part uh, get part method is used for that okay so tree expansion listener is also the interface so which provide the two method white tree collapse and white tree expanded so we should have to know this methods only and our details of that our j tree method and listener it will show it will see in the event handling uh, unit okay so how to create the j tree so first of all you have to create the object of the j tree then we have to create the object of the scroll pen then we have to add the j tree in the scroll pen then uh, we have to add the scroll pen in the content pen object okay of the j applet so in this program i am not going to use the j scroll pen without the j scroll pen i am going to show you the program so now we go to see the j3 program in the net bin okay so click on the project so this is the example of the example of the tree so click here once we click on the jv program it will show us some hidden node then after that we click on the source pack it will show us some hidden uh, node okay so this is the example of the tree we are going to create now so click on uh, default package right click on the default package and create the new j applet form so i am writing here the j tree demo don't uh, take the same uh, name as the j tree which is available in the java package so give the different name j tree demo 2 i am giving name as a j tree demo 2 okay then click on the finish okay just click on the source then write here import java dot awt then import java x dot win import this package then import java x dot win dot tree 
ओके देन पब्लिक क्लास क्लास नेम ऑप्शन है प्लीज जस्ट रिमूव दिस वन देन क्रिएट हियर गेट ट्री गेट ट्री ऑब्जेक्ट आई एम गोइंग टू क्रिएट हियर गेट ट्री ऑब्जेक्ट गेट ट्री ओके देन पब्लिक वाइड इनिशियलाइजेशन then this method uh, to add the container container cp is equal to get contain same okay so create we have created here the object of the container pane then set the layout cp dot set layout new border layout If you use flow layout, then it will not shows the tree properly. So for a good visualization of the tree, we have to use the border layout. Then start creating the node. So which method is used? Which constructor is used? Default mutable tree node is used to create the nodes of the trees. Okay, so. Java is a case sensitive language, so properly write the spelling of the default tree node. Oh, sorry, default mutable tree node. Okay, create the object of this constructor. Default mutable tree node. I am creating the object as a name top. Okay, so top is the object. You can create the any object, any name of the object. So I am creating the select as a top node. Select. So it will show in the output select. Okay. After that, it will show the select as a top. Then below that, I am creating the color. And below that, I am creating the fruit. When you click on the color, it will show the item of the color. When you click on the fruit, it will show the item of the fruit. Okay. So create that one. Another node. This is the top node. Then I am creating here the sub node. Okay. For color, so I am creating the object of the color C color. Okay. Select then color. Then we have to add the item in the color node. So item is nothing but the node of sub node of the color. Okay. So add this hierarchy to the top node. So top dot add of C. Okay. So color is added to the select. Then add the node to the color. Add the node sub node sub color to the color. Okay. Use the same method, same uh, constructor. I am going to just copy and paste. Okay, so I am adding the two item in the color, two node in the color node. So red and blue. Okay, so I am adding here the two node. So change the name of color C one C two. Okay. So use object of the color that is a C. C dot add of C one. C two. C dot add of C two. Now these two nodes are added to the color node and color node is added to the select as a top node. Okay. Then add another node that is fruit. Okay. So copy paste. Uh, for food, I am using the F as a object. Then remain here. Fruit. Okay. So add this fruit to the top node. Okay. Top is the object of the select node. So this is the uh, top node. Then add the uh, item means sub node to the Fruit node. 
okay so i am adding the two nodes so i am giving here a changing the name as a f1 and f2 so what will be the name of the node you can write here so i am writing here the banana and mango okay so just change the name of that uh, f dot f dot and of f1 <coughs> then f2 this program is also available in the manual uh, by using the get roll pan i am using only the simple uh, tree node i am just showing the simple tree node okay so now the all the nodes are added now uh, initialize the j tree object j t is equal to new j tree and write add the top as a object okay so now j tree is added <coughs> now add this j tree with the content pen so instead of the simple j tree you can use uh, scroll pen you can add the item to the scroll pen you can add the j tree in the scroll pen i am not using the scroll pen here okay then add this j tree object to the content pen okay so now the program is over Let's save it and run this program. Okay. You see here. Right click on it. Let it demo. So you see here. So this is the output of the program. Select the top node. When we click on the color, it will show red and blue. If you select on the blue, then it will show the 